I've got my memory into gear now. I remember what we did to you. It was awful, wasn't it? What, the gunking? Or... <laughs> yes, well, we've, we've done you a number we of times, decided, maybe. We yeah. decided we'll never, ever speak to you again. Oh, ever. fine. OK. <coughs> right, well, that's going to be very short, isn't it? So, uh, thank you very much for coming up. It was, it was great. You might have seen uh, a couple of weeks ago, Bobby Davro and Tessa Sanderson were given exactly the same problem, taking part in a fictitious TV show called Out on a Limb. There are various challenges that our intrepid twosome here had to do, and the important thing to remember is that everybody you see, except these two, is in on it, including, of, <laughs> of course, your, your guide, who is running you through the whole thing, and, and generally uh, jollying it on, Shane Ritchie. And also, uh, the tasks will come on screen, so you will see what they have to do. It's good. It's lovely. <laughs> this is what happened. Out on a limb, and Max and Ulrika thought they were taking part in a new BBC TV series being filmed outside the Grand House at Crinkly Bottom, actually. That's what it looks like. You get to be out of them. We have three teams. In my team, well, I'm adjudicating. We've got Rob Gowling and Linda Lasani. Emily Hughes is here. Who have you got with you? I've got the lovely Suzanne Thank and, of you. course, Paul Payne. We Back shall move on. Okay. Shane Richards with us. Who's in your team? I've got the beautiful Ulrika and the not-so-beautiful, but very happy, smiley face, make voice. <laughs> and, uh, You're going to be a tough judge? I'm going to be a very tough. Give me, some rules. Um, well, one of them is, for every penalty point they get, I'll be deducting 15 minutes. All right, good luck to all and sundry. As soon as the shotgun goes, you'll be out the limb. On your marks! Get set! Amazing peace and quiet, yeah? Go! <laughs> Great, you want to get my first gear? Any gear? Uh, where's the gin stick? Oh, there, it's there, there. Yeah. Yeah. That's the first, that's the first. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right, here's your clues. Alright? Get a vicar in a dog collar to take a photo of you both sitting on potties in a shop window. <laughs> Get the vicar to autograph the potties, bring them right, I'm going to have to start deducting points and it's going to be any bad language. What the fuck? Is anybody oh, want that? Like... Right, here's your next challenge. Sing the first three verses of the... Does it have to be done in order? ...either in a bank vault or public library. Does it have to be done in order? No, any order. And the third challenge is both team members to wear togas and find six passers-by to help them reenact the stabbing of Julius Caesar by the side of the Roman bath in Bath. So I reckon right. we get wow. to Bath first. Isn't this beautiful countryside? Don't do the countryside, I'll be worried. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Refreshments. Oh, Never worked so hard in my life. Come and have a lie down in the library. <laughs> I'm just going to borrow some sheets to make into togas. God, not a minute, all. Do you like me to leave a deposit or anything? I can't. <laughs> I haven't got any money. <laughs> this is all on record. I will return them to you within the hour. Is it left on there, though? Right, we've got two sheets. That's sort of like a hundredth of the way there. Where's Max? Hello! <laughs> this is that by the side of the Roman baths, isn't it? Do we have to go inside? Oh, I think it's all about mission and stuff. Can't we do it outside? Yeah, if we go up the steps. Yeah, well, yeah, we've got to get six passes by you first. It's well, a, bit a, a bit of a set. Uh, Come with us. Come with us. This is going to be fun. All you have to do is just stand by and watch it. Please, please, please. And I'll buy you a cup of coffee afterwards. In case it's gone. Read this challenge again. OK. We're running out of time and permission. Right, right. right, what do we have right. to do? Dagger? Is, dagger. This is our dagger. Right, that's a dagger. How is he stabbed? What are you doing? Okay. Friends, Romans and countrymen, <laughs> what, is this, what is this I see before me? An umbrella. It is a dagger dressed up as an umbrella. <laughs> <laughs> I was warned, but I did not listen. Prepare to die, Julius. <laughs> Good one. What is? What is? What is? Thank you. Two white ones. 4.25 each. Goodness. Max! <laughs> Please, I mean, what is? Can you sing a Marseille? Good in it, Owen. No, no, come on. No, no, it's all good. Relax, 
Don't you think we should give him a bonus? Yeah, great. Yeah, fine. Six, this'll be it. So eventually we'll... Hello? Hello? Who's there? Hello? 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 They're all, out, they're, all, they're all administering their flocks. Don't be shy. Hang on. Hang on. Our producer said we could pass you over to Paul Coyer. Hang on. Hey, fancy dress. Oh, hold it. Where's, hold it. where's the fancy dress? Oh, fancy dress hire. Boxes. Where's, Where's uh, the vicar? Yeah, just Imagine. Imagine. You Seems need to take the picture thing, outside. <laughs> how, much, how much time have we got? Shampooing a pig. Paul Coyer, all I heard, heard him say was, get that pig off my leg. <laughs> I can't find it. In. Shall we just take the photograph? Here's I can't shop. find it. Yes, a shop. Excuse me. I don't know. She's better looking than the like garage anyway. Like this. Yeah, there you are. Hello. Stopped when the parties and the photographs are in the safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Listen, it's 4.14. Can you believe we find a vicar in the last seven minutes well, of the... Now watch your speed. I'm going to watch it's my bounce 20 miles phone. an hour. I know. It's so warm. Oh, Max, I've been... I've been glowing Listen, all afternoon. Listen, you want to be... Never <laughs> Listen, you don't need that. Right, stop here. Yeah. Let's get out. Come on, Rika, as quick as possible. Have you got everything, Max? Right. Have you got everything? Probably for three, four. Oh, sorry, I've dropped my pen. We can probably do you a sweet. No, this sweet, sounds busy. What's your name? This is here. Uh, yeah, we with you do you in a moment? With you? Just one second. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oscar Academy and all of that. How long have they well, got them? Have they, have they got them as well? <laughs> well, we, we were early, aren't we? What's Do you want us to get out of the way? Well, could we suggest that yeah. you hide in the library? Yeah. There you go. Excuse me, Arthur. Excuse me, Arthur. You've seen it. A quick, a quick word about it. I can't believe how competitive we were. For such <laughs> I, was, I was willing to die for that program. Yeah. I was willing to die for that program. And all I can remember was some old lady when I was searching for a vicar saying, "Do you know where we could get hold of a vicar?" She said, "Oh, gold." <laughs> Very good. So we now know Ulrika will die for a potty or two. Well done. I think it's marvellous. Max and Ulrika, you're got your. Own. <laughs>